Jordan is a country full of mystery and historical wonders accompanied by unparalleled beauty. Hello guys, welcome to Borden. I'm glad you're joining me to explore 9 tourist attractions and sites in Jordan. So, let's go! al Khazneh, al Khazneh, also known as the Treasury, is one of the most iconic and breathtaking structures in the ancient city of Petra, Jordan. Carved into the rose-red cliffs by the Nabataeans over 2,000 years ago, it stands as a testament to their architectural prowess. The facade of al Khazneh is a stunning example of classical Hellenistic and Eastern architectural fusion, showcasing intricate carvings and a towering presence that leaves visitors awestruck. This monumental structure, measuring about 40 meters in height, served various purposes throughout its history, from being a mausoleum to potentially functioning as a temple or treasury. The name al Khazneh translates to the treasury in Arabic, a moniker that arose from the belief that the urn at the top contained treasures. However, it is now widely accepted that al Khazneh was likely a tomb for a Nabataean king, the entrance to al Khazneh leads through a narrow canyon called the Sik, adding an element of mystery and grandeur to the visitor's journey. Whether seen in the soft light of dawn or the warm hues of sunset, al Khazneh's intricate fawade and historical significance make it a must-see destination for those exploring the archaeological wonders of Petra. Wadi Rum Wadi Rum also known as the Valley of the Moon, is a stunning desert region in the southern part of Jordan. This area is renowned for its dry climate, red sands, and towering rock formations, making it a popular destination for rock climbing and adventurous journeys. One of the unique features of Wadi Rum is the extraordinary shapes and formations of its rocks and mountains, creating mesmerizing and captivating landscapes. The region is rich in ancient petroglyphs, distinctive natural formations, and cultural landmarks. Wadi Rum is recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. As the home to semi-nomadic Bedouin communities, Wadi Rum offers a distinctive cultural and social life for the indigenous people. With their traditional lifestyle, share local myths and stories, providing visitors with an unparalleled experience. With its blue skies and the vast expanse of rocky and arid desert, Wadi Rum stands as one of the captivating natural and cultural destinations in the world. The Dead Sea The Dead Sea, located in the Jordan Rift Valley, is a unique and renowned natural wonder. Bordered by Jordan to the east and Israel and the West Bank to the west, what sets the Dead Sea apart is its extremely high salinity, making it one of the saltiest bodies of water on Earth. This high salinity prevents most aquatic life from thriving in its waters. Hence the name Dead Sea, the mineral-rich mud and salts of the Dead Sea are believed to have therapeutic properties, attracting visitors seeking health and wellness benefits. Many people float effortlessly on the surface of the Dead Sea due to its high salt concentration, making it a distinctive experience and a popular destination for tourists and those interested in holistic treatments. Beyond its unique geological features, the Dead Sea has historical significance. It is often associated with biblical stories and is mentioned in various ancient texts surrounding the sea. You can find historical sites such as the ancient fortress of Masada, adding cultural and archaeological value to the region. The Oval Plaza The Oval Plaza in Jerish, Jordan is a historical archaeological site recognized as one of the most significant Roman markets in the region. This complex is renowned for its geographical location at the heart of the ancient city of Jerish, in close proximity to the Jerish Theater, typically serving as a place for the exchange of goods and services during the Roman era. The plaza features a large square and beautiful architectural structures, reflecting the culture and social life of the Roman period in the area. The Oval Plaza boasts structures such as elegant cylinders and classical columns showcasing roman art and engineering in this location additionally it served as a crucial hub for trade and cultural exchange during later historical periods this site presents a remarkable example of roman civilization in the middle east inviting tourists to embark on a journey through time exploring history and culture 
Alcaraq Castle. Alcaraq Castle, located in the town of Alcaraq in Jordan, is a historic fortress with a rich and storied past. This imposing structure stands atop a hill overlooking the town and the surrounding landscape. Originally built during the Crusader period in the 12th century, the castle has undergone various modifications and expansions over the centuries. The architecture of Karak Castle reflects a blend of European, Islamic, and Crusader influences, making it a unique and captivating site for visitors. The castle played a significant role in the medieval struggles for control over the Holy Land, witnessing battles and changing hands multiple times. One of the remarkable features of Karak Castle is its intricate system of underground tunnels, which serve various purposes, including storage, escape routes, and defensive strategies. These tunnels add an element of mystery to the castle's allure and offer insights into the military tactics of the time. Umquai's Archaeological Site Umquai's, also known as Gadara in antiquity, is an archaeological site located in the northern part of Jordan. This ancient city holds significant historical and cultural importance, dating back to the Hellenistic period, positioned strategically on a ridge, overlooking the Sea of Galilee and the Golan Heights. Umquais offers breathtaking panoramic views and served as a vital member of the Decapolis, a league of ten cities in the eastern part of the Roman Empire. The archaeological site at Umquais features well-preserved ruins that showcase a mix of Roman, Byzantine, and Ottoman influences. Among the notable structures are the Black Basalt Theater, which could accommodate around 3,000 spectators, and the Mausoleum, believed to be the tomb of an important figure from the Roman era. The city's extensive, colonnaded street, public squares, and city walls contribute to the rich tapestry of its historical heritage. Kaiser Azraq, Kaiser Azraq, or Azraq Castle is a historic fortress located in the eastern desert of Jordan, near the town of Azraq. Originally constructed in the 7th century, this fortress has a rich history and has served various purposes over the centuries. Notably, Khazar Azraq gained prominence during the Islamic Umayyad period and was later modified and expanded by the Mamluks and Ottomans. One distinctive feature of Khazar Azraq is its construction using dark basalt stone, providing a stark contrast to the surrounding desert landscape. The fortress served as a crucial military stronghold and caravan station, controlling trade routes and safeguarding the valuable water sources in the arid region. The strategic location of Khazar Azraq made it a pivotal hub for travelers and armies alike, connecting key points in the Middle East. The fortress also holds historical significance due to its association with the famous Arab military leader T.E. Lawrence, also known as Lawrence of Arabia, during World War I. Lawrence utilized Khazar Azraq as a base of operations and later described it in his writings. The King Abdullah Mosque The King Abdullah Mosque in Jordan is associated with King Abdullah II and stands as one of the most significant religious centers in the country, located in the capital, Amman. This mosque is named after King Abdullah II, the current monarch of Jordan. Constructed in recent years, it has become a symbol of peace and tranquility in Jordan. Boasting a beautiful and modern design, with its vast and majestic space, the King Abdullah Mosque in Jordan attracts both local and international tourists, as well as worshippers. Beyond its role as a place of worship, the mosque plays a crucial part in Jordanian society by offering cultural and educational services. Furthermore, it stands as one of the prominent and important temples in Africa and the Middle East. Surrounded by various mausoleums, turning it into a reputable religious and cultural center. The Roman Theater The Roman Theater in Jordan is a captivating archaeological site that reflects the rich history of the region and the influence of Roman civilization. One of the most notable Roman theaters in Jordan is located in Amman, the capital city. This well-preserved structure is believed to date back to the 2nd century c and is situated on the northern side of the Amman citadel. Overlooking the city, the Jordanian Roman theater follows the typical Roman architectural design, featuring a semicircular cavea or seating area carved into the natural slope of the terrain. 
The seating tiers were divided into different sections based on social status. With the high-ranking spectators enjoying a closer proximity to the stage, the theater has a capacity of around six. Zero people making it a significant venue for various performances and public gatherings during the Roman era. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe me. Goodbye.